I'd like to say a huge thank you to everyone who took part in the consultation on the future of youth services. We had an amazing response with almost 500 people taking part, mainly young people. We had two very powerful deputations from young people, a full council and cabinet. And I personally went to youth centres around the borough and I heard young people speak so movingly about the relationship they had with youth workers, talking about them as family, the different changes they'd made in their lives and how much that had meant to them. I think it's testament to the youth workers we have in this borough that we have so many young people who want to positively and constructively engage with the political process. And we've taken what they have to say very seriously. One of the big points made by not just young people, but also the voluntary sector, is the concern around the cuts in universal youth provision, in particular South Camden Youth Access Point. And in the revised proposals, we're going to keep South Camden Youth Access Point open while we look again at how we sustain some of our universal provision over the long term. We're also looking to set up a Camden Young People's Foundation, which is going to be a charitable trust, bringing together our community and third sector partners, different funders, the council, and all those who really want to support young people. I think this is a really exciting opportunity to bring together all the resources we have in Camden around a shared vision for young people. It's also an opportunity to bring in more funding to sustain our universal provision over the long term. We're also going to save two posts which are around youth violence and gang-related activity as part of the really important preventative work we do. And finally, we're going to go ahead with some of the original pro proposals which we hope will improve the service. In particular, ensuring that our brilliant professionals, whether they're youth workers, substance misuse workers or connections workers, are working together in teams as early as possible to support those young people that need it the most. There are still difficult decisions and we're still facing central government cuts. But I think we have some huge assets in Camden, our really engaged young people, our brilliant voluntary sector, our Camden staff, and so many different businesses and organisations that want to support young people. And so I think there's a huge opportunity now to bring all of that together um, in the interest of young people. So I'd welcome anyone who wants to be part of that journey to get in touch with me. Thank you.